starting the stream. I'm I'm here today. I made it today. I know I said I would stream yesterday, and then I didn't. Today's a different day already. How's the weight loss, Simpy? Just checking on you. Weight loss has been pretty good, you know. I put in a lot of. Oh, nice. Right in the. Right, right on Peach. Anyways, uh, weight loss has been good. Thanks for asking. I post my occasional updates on Twitter. I don't uh, post many updates, just the milestones. Alright, so, I know that this is a Zelda hat competition, right? And I know what you're thinking, this doesn't look like Zelda at all. I didn't know it was going to be this bad. Okay, so there were some notes here. Um, I won't get into the specifics of the notes, but I knew that this wasn't the most Zelda-y hack. But I thought, what better experience to start us off with before get dumping in or jumping into one that I know will be a winner? Welcome to the Zelda hacked. This is a penis. You know, I wouldn't be doing my my part in the. Is this just on my screen forever? I actually, don't even know how they did that. I tried to give Beta Bully one horn. How did this happen? Okay. What the frick did I just join to? Welcome, this stuff. Things that happened before Zelda Comp was over. Luigi being found in SM64. <laughs> That's true. That did happen. Well, this is a shit post in all of its literal glory. Life counter? I didn't even see that star because of this fucking thing in the foreground. <laughs> Oh no, I didn't start my timer. Well, that sucks. Now I have to watch the intro again. Uh, probably won't play this hack for very much. And, uh, it's probably getting DQ'd, if I had to guess. But... I still think you guys had to see it. Vic, I don't know what you want from me. I read all your notes. And I was like, cool, this will be a perfect random hack to start my stream with. I feel like that's fine. You don't want to start with the best hack in the world because then not everyone's here to see it. It takes a while for viewers to show up. We are setting horrible conventions. Vic, if you, if you thought this was a DQ, you shouldn't have sent me the file. Yes, submit whatever. I mean, that's only gonna be more, uh... That's only gonna be more cemented when I play a hack that isn't even a Mario 64 hack. Is there anything noteworthy in here? Damn, he, he didn't even change the sign. This is a good hack. Thick chill, dude. We can talk about it later. I, I don't I don't need to explain all the different things that go into running a stream. Maybe I thought it would be funny, Vic. And I kind of do. Total shit. Now, I don't want 100% this game, Mark, because then that'll spoil it. They changed these ones. Everyone changes these ones now. Hey, look! And he thought it wasn't Zelda themed. <laughs> he was right. <laughs> Ooh. You expect the Zelda, but it is the penis level. That's fair. Vic also warned me of this. Did you know there's a hidden face in the dirt texture if you look closely? It looks like a poop monster. Well, that's just the funniest. Okay. Wait, that's my health? That makes sense. I don't know why I didn't think of that before. Drew? I think it's- I think... Given a... God, I need to turn this down more. 
Washington, it was the best thing ever. <laughs> I'm sorry that you dropped your phone in the toilet, dude. Uh, it's actually been a while since I've seen a hack that was like this just shit posty. Kinda... Well, I don't want to say nostalgic, because... I'm not very amused. But it's kinda neat. Kinda neat. I feel like the competition always can benefit from one of these. Uh, wait, can you not fall here? I just want to see if there's another level beyond this one. Oh shit, is that Ray Willie J? That guy does not get enough screen time. Who the fuck made this hack that they're filling it with Ray William Johnson memes? <laughs> A fucking 40 year old made this game. Oh my god, dude. Alright, well. I'm gonna open the polls. You guys ready? This one was called Zelda Legends Untold. Please vote. You vote by typing a number in the chat. I'm gonna go ahead and vote at a high too. Just to piss Vic. Piss him. I'm sorry Vic, don't be mad at me. I didn't know that you didn't want me to stream this ever. I just thought, you know, it was gonna be a bad hack. Um, I do like Puff. Puff is a good addition. And I liked, I liked File Select or whatever it said. Those, that's why I'm, I'm giving it a two. Every other joke was unfunny. Uh, now I'm gonna play a real hack, which I didn't want to necessarily open with while people weren't here, because this should be a really good one. I think it's a two in this stuff. All right, we're moving on to the hole to Hyrule, and Cheesepin and Hero worked on this, so I uh. It's supposed to be a long hack. I deliberately skipped it. I don't want to start the stream with it when uh, not that many people were here, because I expect it's going to be pretty fucking awesome. Uh, so now we'll move on to that. He spins really good at his shit. <laughs> <laughs> I love that little chuckle. I don't know why. All right, let me relaunch the emulator. Please vote on that last one if you haven't, because it's going to make any difference. Even though we're DQing it. Uh, but vote anyway, because it's fun. That was the fastest competition hack so far. It took five minutes instead of 50 <laughs> plus. I say 50 as if that's some sort of exaggeration, but it really isn't. A lot of them have taken several hours. All right, closing the poll. Thank you all, 297 people, for voting. Think it's worth its own vid? Absolutely not. I wish it was funny enough to be its own video, but it was just loud and shitty. Uh, which is unfortunate. So this is Hold a High Roll by Cheesepin and Hero Techni. Um, it should be sick. I've looked forward to this one, I've been excited for this one. Uh, ever, ever since I saw it in the spreadsheet, I knew one day I'd play that game and I would be excited to play it. But we are gonna have to DQ it because I have yet to see anything Zelda related. We're moving on to the next hack. The music is fucking weird. Oh, I should turn the music back up now that it's not that last game. You guys hear the, like, piano noises? Yeah, yeah, I turned it up. I got you guys. I like this piano instrument. Oh god. <laughs> this is the hole to Hyrule, dude. Mario Mario, check out the hole here. It's kind of freaky. Mario, you see this cool hole here? I totally want to jump and do it. The princess says that I can't, though. A bit low in the base. Yeah, it's like Grady. It's, uh... It's like all the slam of the piano, none of the... notes. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Thank you for showing up on such short notice. I truly appreciate it. I'm sure you got my letter about the mysterious hole that opened up here. 
Nobody knows how it got here or what's on the other side. If you could investigate it for us, I would appreciate it more than you would ever know. Thank you, Mario. Um, I, let me see if there was a readme to the fact I might have missed. Just because it mentioned that there was a letter. I don't recall a letter. I might have missed a readme. Simple, you so funny, man. You should be a comedian, goddamn. What did I do that was funny? Also, thank you. Uh, I probably should be a comedian, but I don't know. They'd never hand me the mic and fucking make every other comedian in the world look like they're not funny. They just won't do it. <laughs> I'm a tired. All right, where is this? There was a read me. Okay, okay. Glide N64 is recommended but not required. Use counter factor one, which I did. Also, make sure your D-pad buttons are registered, which they are. Cool. I'm not using Glide though. I could switch to that version of Glide. I think I'll just do it now and avoid future complications. I think everyone would agree that that's a smart idea. I should have save stated, but that's okay. The pad buttons needing to be mapped is gonna. Fuck, why don't I save state? <laughs> Damn it. Uh, D-pad buttons needing to be mapped means that there's probably some really cool shit in this game. It should work on every plugin. I, I'm just trying, you know, I feel like so many times I've had like shitty textures that f misrepresent the game. I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to do my shit, you know? I want everyone to vote low on your hat because it sucks, not because I suck. <laughs> That's the goal, you know? Show the hack in the, it's proper lighting. It's okay though, it took like no time to get back here. I kind of schmooved on him, to be honest. Damn, that is a big hole. Oh my fucking god, what is happening to my eyeballs right now? Dude, I love shit like this. What? Navi? <laughs> what the hell? Ooh, looks like you took quite the fall. Voice acting okay? in Mario? <laughs> I'm Eros, and I've been waiting for someone to I'm just kidding, I don't like putting myself in so thumbnails. Let's set some things straight. You're in Hyrule. It's the home of that Link guy you fought and raised skull carts with. There's a big problem, though. This gets a 10 because I don't have to read anything. Reincarnation. Alongside that, the princess of the royal family has been kidnapped by an evil sorcerer. I'm assuming, in a last-ditch effort, the goddesses have opened a portal between here and your world to lend us an extra hand. It sounds pretty Please, good for Mario 64 audio. I always expect it to be crunchy and shitty. All right, then it's set. Let's go, Mario. Hey! That is Vic, isn't it? Is that actually Vic? That's so <laughs> fucking cool. <laughs> it sounds exactly like him if it's not him. Oh shit, I got the boomerang? You have never played a fucking Zelda game if you think you're supposed to get the boomerang first. Hit C up to go into first person mode, aim and use the D-pad to fire. Holy shit. Dude, look at this. What the fuck? This is so smooth. I shouldn't- this is so smooth. Mario C up camera is shitty. Always has been. It's always been laggy as balls. It's always been based on how Mario's neck can move. It's like, it's always been terrible, but this is pretty good. Uh, I'm gonna D-pad down that shit. Wow, that is really smooth. Save blocks? Fuck, I can't hear this song without thinking someone's about to... Bit some hot fire. Do it. This is a really good song, I do like it. Oh shit, how do I listen? Hold on. Vic, speak to me. <laughs> Look behind the moving walls, the key to the gate may be there. Thanks, Vic. <laughs> I, I really do hope it's Vic and it's not someone that sounds like Vic. Alright, well I've been playing a lot of CSGO, that's an easy one. They didn't know I was fucking training for this heck. Yeah. 
interesting. Okay. Victorcore is confirming in chat that it's him, but I'm not convinced yet. It seems like the targets in this room work a bit differently. Look carefully before charging ahead. Drew? Oh. Listen. It sounds exactly like Vic. Vic is saying, that's my voice, dumbass, and I just don't believe him. Oh look, there's a lot in this room. There's a save block here. If you want to take a break, just hit it and come back later. I've heard that certain blocks will also spawn checkpoints, so if you die, like that happened. It also looks like there's a key door. We need to look a bit further to find its key. True, true. Uh, I assume this is only to get back. I want to talk to the great wise Goomba of the north. I uh, don't fall. What are you, some kind of boss? Hello, fine traveler. I'm selling some potions here at my shop shack. The price... They only cost 20 coins apiece. Do you want one? I don't know where I get the word price from. I would grab one of those. I would nab one of those. But I, uh, I just don't take damage. That's the only thing. Okay. I see. That's a long fuse. I actually don't know if, with any certainty if that's any longer fuse than normal. What up? These bombs are pushy. They don't seem to want to lose their ground. It doesn't look like you can pick them up. Is it possible to get them to explode some other way? I don't know. You tell me. Fucking idiot. I'm not even going to destroy the other one, I'm going to flex on him instead. True. Oh man. <laughs> I fucking... Blast my angle, I don't know. I don't know what to say. I did it again. I couldn't... What? That time... Alright, I don't know what to believe anymore. I'm just going. Top of the game is cropped off. God damn it. It's because I changed the graphics plugin. Thank you for pointing that out. Let me fix it. That doesn't look right. There we go. Probably some uh, cropage down here too that needs some work. Alright guys, you aren't going to like what you see. It's not going to be pretty. What is this Super Mario 64 game coming from my favorite professional Tetris 99 stream? <laughs> Dude, I'm going to have to bring back the Tetris streams now that a new Tetris game's coming out. Everyone's going to be a noob. Can you, can you imagine how exciting day one's going to be where everyone is going to have noob rank so you can just queue with everyone and I'll just be slaying noobs. That's what I do. It won't be impressive at all. It'll just be like, you know, beating up a small child or something. But I'll be doing it. <laughs> what better time to donate than when I'm talking about beating up children? Thank you. Free one mem two. Um. I, oh, what the fuck? Hello? The back-to-back? -back? Thank you, damn Pharaoh. Thank you, Kree. Damn it. You'll see some schmooze. Thanks, dude. Um, yeah, I do want to stream more CSGO and continue getting better at that game. Uh, it's kind of a hard game to stream, to be honest, without having your frame rate be all shitty. They introduced something called Trust Factor, or uh, Trusted Mode, rather. So, like, games like, or apps like OBS can't interact with the game anymore, so you can only record it in full screen display capture. And then that just makes your game so choppy and shitty. Uh, so it's kind of a hard game to stream. 
I think people who stream it are like using two computers usually now. Okay, you got the fire rod. This powerful item will give you the ability to spawn devastating balls of fire at will. Use the d-pad to equip the item and use B while on the ground to shoot fireballs. Okay. Yeah, and they don't have the non-trusted launch options anymore, which honestly I like the trusted mode shit because there's so many cheaters in that game. Uh, wait, no, I want this to be... Oh, they swap! Dude, they do the thing in, that they do in Zelda, which is swap places when you uh, try to assign it over another item. I've always loved this. I, I didn't expect it to be part of this game. Not that it really matters all that much. I still think it's cool. <laughs> I still think it's cool. I've always loved that just from Zelda as well. Well, now I don't know what to do, to do with my, uh, I, don't, I still don't want your potion. Now I don't know what to do with <clears throat> the fire rod. Maybe I can burn that vine thing. I bet that's what it is. We're taking down vine a second time, boys. Huh. I really thought that would be it. Oh, it was it? I just suck, I guess. Listen. What's up, Vic? What do you got for me? Looks like there's some torches here. Wonder what'll happen when you light one up. Oh shit. Yeah. I don't think you can light one up on Twitch. I don't think it lets you do that. As if I even need these platforms. Get out of here. That was actually really scary. <laughs> Only because I landed on an invisible platform. Dude, I gotta be honest. Much like this game, Vic is someone who will say, listen to me when I least expect it and tell me some shit. But that's the best thing about Vic, dude. I've, I never knew how much I needed this in a Mario 64 game as well. I just thought that was a life coach type of thing. Dude, could I have moved on over here? Yo, what up, Vic? It looks like you need four keys to proceed from this room. Seems like the torch in the middle might help you though. Cool. Oh, I have unlocked shortcut? Perhaps? Yeah. Okay. Is this where I just came from? Nah, no, I'm dumb. I climbed first. Anyway, have a good stream and good luck. Thank you. I appreciate that. Fuck. Okay, I did get it. Thanks, Schmoobs McGrooves. I like your name, by the way. Mark, what are you doing today? He asked for no particular reason. Oh, I see. I'm gonna get this. How could you? That was complete and utter bullshit, but I'll take it. You're watching a movie with lead at nine? Damn. But I would give dev friends. All the way back here? Well, that... That shortcut I unlock certainly makes sense now. We can be friends. You know what? That's it, Mark. When you're looking back at life, just remember you're the reason I started hanging out with damn pharaohs every day. <laughs> Everyone posts in lol except damn pharaohs who's posting Marcus sub. Where's my next, uh, bibliograph? Fuck, I pushed the wrong button. Yellow? Yahoo! 
One key. Oh, I'm gonna need four of these. Maybe ground pounding on a fat dick is the way to go here. <laughs> Especially because I think I can get a health refill for 20 coins. Yeah, running all the way back or doing all that platforming to get back here. No, thank you. Oh shit, I was looking at chat and was just walked out into the void. Wait, do these things ricochet? Wait, hold on. They do! The f I was for sure thinking this was gonna be a boomerang obstacle. That is so cool. If you guys aren't if you guys aren't actively thinking about how cool this game is, then I don't know what you're doing. Get him. Ricochet him. Suck his dick, dude, no. This is so cool. You know I'm just gonna schmoove it in there. Perfect angle every time. Hold on, let me have this camera. Now that I have this camera, schmurfic sh schmingle, every schmine. Damn, I can't do anything right. <laughs> I was just trying to jump down. All right, let's see. I was curious if uh, buying something from the Goomba was gonna be its own item or if it's just a straight up health refill. So, for that reason alone, I gotta do this. Yeah, sell me one. Oh, it is just an item, dude. Instant health refill, good for one use. I'll buy another one then, fuck it. Give me one, give me one, give me one, give me one, buy me one. Oh yeah, shit, we didn't even talk about the fact that there's a map here. And I know how to use it, trust me. I know how to move Mario's head up and down. I fucking swear I do. Maybe I just haven't gotten that far. Sorry if you guys hear those like audio pops. Uh, there is usually a way to disable those, but like I've already changed the setting that that's usually relevant to. I couldn't really make them go away. Uh, I, don't, I don't know how many people even notice that. Fuck. I thought I could stand on those torches and just skip half of the shit. I assume that there's a lot of complex stuff going on in this game. I mean, there really just straight up is that's causing the audio pops, but if there's a way to fix it, I don't I don't know how to fix it. Here's five bucks to help until you hopefully get that sub button back. Thanks for the hey. rewatchable content. Thanks, dude. I'm sure I'll get it back someday. Can I just make it? Can I make it from below? Dude, that's my platform right there. Oh, did I hit an invisible platform? Fuck, <laughs> I was going for the wall. Damn it. Don't do that. Okay, I don't think I can reach that high. But it's so close, it really is. Like right at the bottom of what I can reach. <laughs> or uh, what I can't reach. This. The fact is simple proof, you know? Part of good level design is, you know, actually enforcing the particular way to play the level. Not that it really matters that much. What's in here? Can I have it? Give me the goods. I like this cutscene. I have bombs now? We're just bombs now? I have bombs? I have zero bombs. 
to be exact. I wish I had read the instructions a bit more, but I was just sort of perplexed by the fact that I had bombs. Is it a collection concept? Do I have to... Maybe I just find them somewhere? Maybe it says on the pause screen. I really regret not reading the rules. Fuck. Cheese Spin, are you here? I missed some crucial text. I really did not mean to not read that. But I was so amazed by bombs that I had dropped bombs. This is something about Z. Aw, oh, shit. I keep pushing the wrong button. I'll figure out how to get bombs. Earlier I, s I saw enemies dropping hearts, so they probably dropped bombs too. Oh, what the fuck? Bro, I found them. Oh, it should just, it just explodes. It explodes quick. <laughs> and it also doesn't blow up the wall. <laughs> Get the single fucking way from me. Eh, fuck me. Health potion. Oh shit, you're right. It just dropped me at the beginning of the dungeon, though, that's fine. I should probably grab another bomb. Oh, this is easy. Oh, this is timed! Okay. <laughs> Fuck! These things explode so fast, it's insane! Did these set it off? Oh, okay. Nah, you just you just go at your own fucking pace when when you I'm not the one panicking. <laughs> I really miss that explanation text at the beginning. Oh my god, that's so sick. I don't know why I didn't grab the extra bomb just then, but this is really cool. Uh, I don't need anything more. Dude, I'm sure I, I, okay. I expected it to drop me at the beginning of the dungeon because I wanted to refill my bombs, but if I need bombs, I'm sure Cheesepin will give me bombs again. Cheesepin's always been pretty good at level design stuff, in my opinion. That momentum? Oh shit, I'm gonna get to hear Vic talk to me. Let's go. I'm so excited. I'm ready for you, Vic. Oh, so you recognize me. Good to know the goddesses have spread my name far and wide. Of course I know you. You're the one, You're who, the one who captured the princess of the royal family. I love this. You would never understand. Zelda is an important piece of the puzzle for my plan of ruin for Hyrule. Forget you, fairy fool. Red man. You're the traveler who conquered my illustrious dungeon. Who might you be? His name is Mario, and he has proven himself to be a valiant hero, strong enough to stop the likes of you. <laughs> is that so? Red man, you guys are so well, dumb. I would love to see you try to stop me. If you can get out of here alive. I wish Vic had voice acted that. Wait, oh no, I was gonna listen! <laughs> Vic, I listened to you, I swear. I wasn't ready. <laughs> Fuck! That movement is not gonna fly here. <laughs> ah shit.
Give me up. That rock doesn't give a fuck about terrain. It'll go through anything. I'm digging this. Duh. So dumb. Right, I can just move at like a reasonable pace. I don't have to worry too much. <clears throat> that fucking piano chase. Do you guys remember that? You guys remember how hard that was? Does, was anyone here for that stream that's here right now? This is a lot more insane, or a lot less insane in terms of how difficult it is. At a, at a glance, anyway. But, that piano shit's got me real PTSD thinking that whenever I see a section that looks like this, I gotta haul all ass. That was the one where Network spilled all the tea? Really? That was that day? That's insane. I don't ever think of network spilling all that tea as like tied to any of my other real life events. I just, I just know that that's something that happened, that's something we all had to get by and get through. Oh my god, you're Mario, right? It's been so long since I've seen you. Remember when you took down the big a bomb at the battlefield? I was that pink one who helped you open the cannon. It's been so long, man. Me and a lot of others fell into a hole and ended up here a while ago. Maybe it's been like 10, 15 years. It's been a while since you, anybody new has come. I assume that the hole closed completely. How did you even get here? Anyway, we set up shop in this quaint little field and we've been getting along nicely. Take a look around, don't be shy. Well, let's fucking go. I don't have the heart to tell him that I never needed that camera or a cannon to begin with. It was com I I I fucked I fucked King Bomb B B Bomb, you know? Like I it had nothing to do with the cannon. It had to do with my glutes and pure strength. But that's a nice guy. I'm not going to go ahead and fucking tell him that I didn't need him. He remembers me clearly. Oh no, no, our poor Toadette has gone missing. She ran off towards the mountain and now we can't find her. Maybe she's near the peak looking for something. Sir, could you kindly retrieve Toadette for us? Check around the peak of the, of the spiral path. There's no way she's gone past it. True, true. Does Mario have glutes? That'll be the last question you ever ask before you see them, so maybe be careful what you're saying. Hello, fine traveler. I'm selling some potions. Uh, am I allowed to carry more than one? Oh, I am not. I like it though. Makes it less overwhelming. You know, even in, even if we're safe in this town, there's some evil lurking higher up. The evil mage Vati lives at the top of the mountain, hiding away in his sky temple. Sometimes he comes down just to steal away our stuff. Of course, no one has the power to stop him. He shows up, takes what he wants, and leaves. I've even heard that he took the princess. No one has seen her for quite some time. No one has even stepped foot in his temple either. The door to his temple is guarded by an ancient lock. After so many years, not a single person knows where the key might be. What a shame. True. We should contact our resident key expert and see what he thinks. If you don't know who that is, it's Luigi. And if you don't know why it's Luigi, I'm not gonna tell you. <laughs> But it is Luigi. Canon. Nintendo Canon. Uh, okay. Should hit this. Oh, I did talk to this one already. You think the game music's pretty loud? I completely agree with you. Thank you for telling me that. It, the last song wasn't as loud as that as this one was. I can promise you that I wouldn't let fucking yellow audio running amok inside of OBS when I'm the yellow king. You can't have two yellows. You get you get one red, you get one yellow, and everything else has to be green. That's how OBS works. Oh, what the fuck? I didn't even see this. And I might be able to go in this chimney too for extra bonus points. I made myself the Yellow King, because the audio suggested it. Cube. I like that. 
Collect all four to increase your maximum health. So is there only four of them? Wow. That's really cool. I like Cube Mungus, that's a good one. Well shit, I hope I didn't miss one already. I, I, I feel like I probably didn't, but I hope I didn't. Oh, and Baby's first platforming obstacle to get the other one? Let's go. What if he missed one already? Can someone ban... Ugh, God damn it! Can someone ban damn Pharaohs? Enough is enough, dude! I want Mark back! <laughs> I'm enjoying this game so far. What song is this? I gotta see if there's a heart container deep in the waters. Does anyone know what song this is? But if you don't know what the song is, let me tell you. It's from Pokemon Snap 2. Part of the leaked music, and I'm sorry to be the one spoiling the song for you. However, if you do know what the song is, disregard what I said. Hey Mario, is this your first run around Vadi's Mountain? This isn't the easiest course, you'd better be careful on these slopes. How about a race to the mountaintop? You better be careful! But how about the most dangerous way we could traverse the mountain? I'm down for the heart piece. How about the most reckless and- What? I got cheese! Look how fast he's going! He fucking set up little traps around the map. BLJ incoming. I don't know if any of this has been steep enough to BLJ, although it's starting to look a little bit more convincing. I'm, I'm uncertain if any of this has been steep enough to BLJ yet. Give me the heart. Do it! Sorry. Uh, you really are fast. A human blur. Here you go. Thank you. Wow, I fucking really enjoyed that sound effect. You thought Navi was a green demon? That's funny. Did you know Navi is exactly like Victoricor? Cub, are you following with this analogy? Tub, do you agree that Navi and Victoricor are basically exactly alike in this game? Howdy, red boy. I'm having a great time mining out the core of this mountain. There's so many materials no one here would have ever found. My friends must be so worried about me, but who's going to do this if not me? I don't think I'm going to be coming back for a while. I still have tons of work to do. If you want, you can take this key I dug up. <laughs> There's no turn skips in Mario Party. I can't figure out how to use it, maybe you can. Thank you for the key. Fast travel? Oh, all the way back here though. This is not steep enough, I'm almost certain. There's turn skips in Mario Party 1. Okay, well, I'm gonna be completely honest with you. I did not know that. I literally had no idea. That is the most fucked up thing I've ever heard. In my life, probably. That's why it's the worst Mario Party. I don't know if it's the worst Mario Party. But it is the one I most judge by its cover and never want to play. So at the very least, it looks the most boring. It might actually be. Listen! There's a grave here. I think we should check it out. Oh, actually, I see a heart piece really high up, but how can you get to it? I love this song. I'm sad to say. Uh, only only kind of sad, because it is a, g a good piece of 
of art, of music. Uh, but regardless, I'm sad to say that when I hear this song, I hear the fucking bup version in my head. Can I boomerang it? I dropped a bomb, did I? I don't know if the interaction isn't there or if it's just too far. It doesn't look like it gets to it. I'm gonna do the grave first, I guess. Oh, my soul! <laughs> I got the spin drift mask, which I did not expect to be in this game. Wearing this remnant of the past on your face turns you into a mysterious alternate form. Hold A while single double jumping or flipping to fall down much more slowly. Watch your flower gauge though, if all the petals fall off you'll start falling too. Your movement speed is reduced as well, no more triple long jumps or wall kicks in this form, however you can fly up in special tornadoes. Finally press B while running to perform a spinning attack. You'll automatically jump off ledges, giving you a speed boost. You can do that in other Mario Party games as well. I used to do that in 2 when I was trying to get as many coins as possible to buy all the minigames. Uh, you'll automatically jump off ledges, giving you a speed boost, and you can attack enemies too. Use the mask item on the d-pad to take it on or off. Okay. So there's one more item. I guess I don't need bombs right now. I don't really need the other things either. Oh, there's a whole fucking... He did the whole thing. <laughs> Okay. It said I can't long jump, right? Yeah, I just backflip. Even with speed. That's really bizarre. That's an extra hurt. The pedal animation is so pretty. I didn't look at it. Let me... Oh, do you mean on Mario's head? You've collected all four heart pieces. The power of the pieces upgrade your maximum health. Yeah, if you're talking about on Mario's head, I actually think that's done extremely well. That is really nice. And the way they fall off on that meter to the side is actually really good too. I don't know which one you're talking about, but literally both of them are sick. No HP refill cringe. That is a little cringe. I agree. Is this where I came from? I don't think so. It just looks similar on both ends. You would get annoyed by the fact that you have to see the cutscene every time? Well, that's what happens in Majora's Mask. I'm pretty sure other people were annoyed about that too. It's not so bad though. You can skip it in Majora's Mask? Well, today I fucking learned. Maybe you can skip it in this game and I didn't even try. I'll check that out in a second. Hey, Bilbo, Baggins, just an inconspicuous signpost here. I'm glad you found me. There's no way I could get down from here. Here's a tip for your troubles. You can press start during the mask cutscene to skip it. Well, how fucking on topic is that? <laughs> can you believe that? Isn't that neat? <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> I can't believe how often stuff like that happens. And again, honestly, just another testament to how sick Cheese Pin is when it comes to making these kind of games. Oh, this is a real tree. Wow. That... That is a pretty good looking real tree, I will give you that. I thought it was geometry at first. Dude, that sounds exactly like Vic. It looks like we finally arrived at the Sky Temple. If the princess isn't here, maybe we can get a clue. 
You should use that transformation mask often, it seems pretty useful. You right. I'm saving the game. Uh, shit. Is that gonna blow me too? You can skip it. It is true. I just hate how fucking slow you move. Ah, do not blow me off, dude. Try auto jump. I, I've seen you mention that, or I've seen that mentioned a couple times. I don't know how, how to do the auto jump. Another key door and a gate too, just what we needed. I forgot there was a spin attack with the B button, but I don't know what the auto jump is. Oh shit, yeah, I should be doing this every fucking moment possible. Whoa. Is that backwards momentum? It is, how does that work? <laughs> you just spin off an edge to auto jump. Okay, I'll try that in a little bit. Not the greatest auto jump, but it has spin drift physics. I can go neutral and keep my speed, I would love that. Or maybe not. Maybe it's hard coded to reduce. Uh oh. I'm dead. I don't like the auto jump, but it kind of sucks. You can't wall jump. Yeah, I remembered too late. That's fun. I would say for the most part, I just prefer Mario's platforming. There's not like really any cool speed shit I can do. I'm gonna grab these. For all those potions I don't use. Alright, what's this doing? Uh, said I wouldn't be able to triple jump anymore, right? Can I speed kick out of a... Out of a twirl? Huh. How bizarre. Oh my god, how annoying is what I meant to say. Jesus. God, get back. <laughs> Dude, this is so glitchy. <laughs> oh, no, 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 do not prolong my burn. Fuck, I'm losing so much health. <laughs> I didn't want to die, it was die or get burned half alive. Both of them were almost the same fucking thing. Oh shit. Uh, here, give me that. That's neat. Will this blow me? No blowy physics. Okay. Alright, I'm sticking to Mario physics as much as I can. 
The other thing only invites dumb shit into my life, which I'm not necessarily opposed to. Wrong button. This is a peculiar room. There's a fan in the center and a few blocks scattered around the doorways. What if we could push all the blocks with the one fan? Oh god. That's some puzzle, huh? Look at Mario in the background schmoovin', dude! That's kinda cool. Wow, this is quite the height to get up. I wonder if we can use that metal thing down here. You've seen it, right? I think it's a pullable block. Oh, shit. Or, I'm just spitballing here with my ideas. There is nowhere to go over there, never mind. Save, save, save. It'll be fine, guys. When I die, I just go back to the beginning. No save required. I'm just back at the beginning of the dungeon. Exactly! <laughs> Look, I'm about to get 100 rupees and then none of you guys will ever be able to talk shit again. See? Oh, how interesting this layout. This is pretty cool. This is actually just unique as fuck in my opinion. Alright, what does this do? Does this move the fan? Okay, that's a lot less overwhelming. You're crying because there's no 100 coin star? I'm in Hyrule, dude. The, you're, you're, you're thinking with Mushroom Kingdom rule sets. That's just not how it works. Alright, let's see what this one is. What the fuck did that do? <laughs> Hello. Wait. Wait, what? <laughs> Am I okay? Am I gonna be alright? What the hell? I'm blind? Am I blind and stupid? Or, uh, someone wanna reveal the secrets to me? Okay, I guess I just somehow didn't notice that before. Uh oh. I'm supposed to be using the thing here! Okay. Christy? Triple jump? Aww. I like the cutscenes. More and more hacks are doing the, those kinds of cutscenes. I don't know how hard they are to do, I'm not gonna pretend it's like... ...the cure for cancer or something. I just like it. I didn't have that kind of shit in hacks for forever. I never saw it. Are you selling big potions? Okay. I should save again, probably. <laughs> there we go. I should put the mask on. I shouldn't put it on there! This is fine. The mask would have actually fucked me, I bet. Whoa! <laughs> what the fuck? I did save. Magic cape. The gold-lined fabric will shield you from the gaze of your foes. 
While the cape is enabled, no enemy will be able to see you. You can also use it to pass through thin gated walls. Okay. That makes sense. You only have a small amount of magic, so use the cape when needed. You also can't use a spindrift cape while in spindrift form. Did they mean to say mask? Wait. Oh, I, I added a word. Okay. You also can't use the cape while in spindrift form. I'm dyslexic. To refill your magic, simply step on a magical green pad. Okay. Yeah, that was actual dyslexia. Uh, well, I'm gonna equip... Wow, that's a really cool looking thing. It do be draining pretty quickly. It is kind of like a glorified Vanish Cup. But that's cool. Bigger Goomba, bigger potion is what I thought, but Jesus. These guys are dickheads. I don't have D-pads mapped on my input display, but I promise you I hit D-pad down like four times. Do I need to not be moving when I do it, or what's the deal? I had no problem moving that time. What's this shit? Oh, nice. Is he gonna attack me? Give me. Nah, I mean, this is just easier. The Spindrift Mask is a liability. Er, or rather, I'm a liability when I use one. Why would I not get the full magic? What is wrong with me? Fuck, I let go of it too soon. I'm gonna save the game. Yeah, I probably should have did the Spindrift one on that one. Vic, if you hear those pops, I swear it's not me, dude. I can't- I don't know how to fix it. Uh... I guess we'll use this. Oh yeah, you can't long jump anymore. It's just a particular instrument. Good to know. Listen. Yo, what up, Vic? Wrong button, Vic. Look what you've done to me, Vic. <laughs> huh, what a strange door. It doesn't seem like we can burn it down, but there's a rope leading to it. What if we could burn down the rope? So, I've come to the assessment that listening to Navi is your get out of jail free card when you cannot solve the puzzle. I probably don't need to talk to Navi every single time. Uh, but you know, Vic says, listen, I get all excited just to hear his voice. Huh. Oh, I can do the most reckless thing. Do you guys want to see it? I'm doing it. They put wind here. <laughs> that makes sense. Uh, this amount of recklessness was not worth it. All the way back here. Screw. Fuck. What? All right. Shit. That guy has superpowers. Damn Thanos locked by in a cage somehow. That's insane! Didn't I literally respawn here earlier? Why the fuck did they put me all the way back at the beginning? <laughs> Didn't I already have a checkpoint? That's alright. Silly things happen sometimes. I died out of health. That sucks. I forgot health was even a thing in this game. 
kinda. Only partially real. Yahoo! I definitely wouldn't have been going for X game shit if I knew that <laughs> I wasn't gonna game over. Well... I don't really... Is this... Is this obvious to everyone else? What did you say? But there's a rope leading to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know how to burn this rope. It's not like I can go over here. Oh! Wait! What the fuck? <laughs> it just be doing this to me. Wait, I can still fire the comrade while I'm squished. Okay. Wait, I just I did it. I I did it. No. Get it. Fuck, there's all sorts of things here. Okay, I got one. Okay. No! Bullshit, buddy! No! Not unless I get equipped this in midair. Are you? I, I, okay. <laughs> Guys, we don't question. We don't question uh, higher powers intervening. We just say thank you. paying much attention. There's a lot to think about. I was reading chat, which that in itself mistake, you know? I know, this is really cool. Oh, a small speed boost to put up the Minani. So I hit those three things before. And then walked off, I guess. What is my what is my goal here? Am I just going over here? Like, do I care about any of this seemingly extra shit? Do I just go over here? What the fuck is this is such a weird room to me. Shit. Okay, I see. You just have to go fast. Long jumps aren't the answer. Oh, they might be. I'm just gonna long jump, I guess. They nearly worked the first time. Uh, bummer. Fuck. I- I know, people are telling me to just jump in the pit whenever I die. I thought, 
You guys are good. Oh, maybe you do want long jumps. I could just go to the end and then wall kick my way up, though. Which is maybe what I'm doing now. Even save magic that way. Oh. Oh, fuck! I forgot I was even in this dungeon. That's how long that extended route was. Big money. I'm I'm death warping. Wait, did I want to do that? Oh, right, because of this. Wait, I actually don't know now. Am I facing regret? I'm confused a little bit. I'm, I'm sure I didn't break it by falling in a pit. I'm sure things are fine. You just have to find out where to go. Listen. What's up, dude? I think we should head back. Oh, this is an infinite dick. Huh. Well, Vic's right, you know, when, when you're right, you're right. Oh, God. What the fuck? Probably should have saved there. I think we're fine, guys. I think, I think, you know, I'm, I'm right on target here. Shit. Ultra shit. What? How am I here now? <laughs> Okay. Listen. Uh, wait, am I supposed to be here? What the? Where's your precious princess now? <laughs> this isn't funny, Vadi. How do I always get to the end of the game on accident? She's helping me seek the destruction of Hyrule, of course. Teespin, did I miss something? She'd never willingly help you. We'll okay, Chief's been said it's fine, you didn't miss much. Probably some platforming. Oh, so you still think you can stop me? Of course we can. Mario has more power in his heart than you ever will. It sounds like Vic. You guys think that? That means nothing compared to my strength. It means so much more than you'll ever know, you heartless freak. Dude, that's how Vic speaks, <laughs> literally. We'll see if that still matters after your heart is ripped to shreds. <laughs> Sorry, I can't help myself. Alright, eyeball bitch! To die by my hand. Oh, fuck. I can talk like that too, but you think that scares me? A little frequency. Sorry, that was probably really loud. <laughs> it happened so fast. <laughs> Alright, what items do I need here? Probably this, this, and this, if I had to guess. Oh, I see now. They're uh, indicated on the ground before they blow me up. Don't. You wouldn't. You couldn't. Oh, I'm not wasting my potion learning the boss, that's for sure. Oh, fire fuck! Dude, that's bullshit. I'm not even dead right there. 
Okay, that was kind of cool. So I can't tell if this is survival section or if I'm... Oh my god, dude. I'm blind. Dude, stop. I'm trying to figure out some shit, alright? Dude, knock it off! I just want to see if I can even throw the boomerang in this room. I can. You like it better when I didn't shout all the time? True. That was before I sold out. Baddies transformed, you have to take him down, Mario. I have a sneaking suspicion items won't work on him. You need to attack him some other way, wait for an opening and strike. And when he shoots those magic balls at you? Link has seen them before? I think he swung his sword at them to send them back, but you don't have a sword. How else could you reflect it? Why would Link see his balls? Okay. Kick move! Well, that wasn't a kick, but it was a move, and I think I did damage. Ow. I like this. I think... I think the occasional voice lines, so what the boss is doing, the area, I think all of it's so cool. I'm just gonna try and be mirrored of his position at all times, and that should, uh, give me an opportunity to strike. Can I hit him without getting hit? Am I hitting him? Is another good question. My eyeball hit move? Bro. You're right. There we go, now I'm like perfectly mirrored of him. You come in. Punch! Everything hurts me. Maybe I should... Maybe I should ground him. The spin drift thing. Not mad, but... I'm surprised you can even do this in here. Wait. Can I not? Yeah, it doesn't work in here. Maybe your projectile weapons? Nah. Vic said items don't work, but in-game, and it sounded exactly like him. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Fuck! Okay, well, ground pound is the answer. I keep thinking these coins are gonna heal me. I didn't buy a potion before I came in here. I thought I owned one still, but I didn't buy another one. Ah, uh, bummer. Punch of the bombs at it. I've already figured out that ground pound is the way to uh, damage him. He goes. He gets, like, really cold for a second. <laughs> I like that noise. Alright, now how do I have to reflect this back? There it is. Now I hit him with the ground pound, the one-two, and he kills me. I probably could have ground pounded him, I just missed. And I was a little bit afraid of touching him. The arena is red, oh! Okay. Fuck everything I knew about the world. I've never seen a hack do that to me, I think. I will say this, I don't like that effect in Mario Maker. I hate it here.
<laughs> I can't help, dude. <laughs> Fuck off! I can't see anything like this. Where am I? This makes me sick, dude. I can't handle it. Oh, that damaged me. Damn it. Damage. Wait. We're gonna wanna slide kick that. And then I'm gonna triple jump. And he, she, he fucking reflected it again! And it teleported. <laughs> I wasn't ready to have to hit it back more than once, although it does make perfectly good sense. Oh! Shit! Shouldn't be doing backflips during... Tennis, I guess. It did pick up speed, that's what's scary. This move is out for like a million frames. I cannot damage that man. I, well, what do you expect me to do? Alright, I'm gonna throw a boomerang at you. Would you like a bomb? Would you like the world's heaviest bomb? I didn't, I can't ground pound this thing without dying, I feel like. Okay. It oscillates back and forth a little bit. You fucking bitch. Cheater. I don't know if I got it. I don't know why I was doing that. Sure, sure, sure. Don't let me get away. I didn't get him! Somehow, I did not. I did not. Did you hear that? I hit him- I hit him in the past! This game really is a Zelda game. Time travel. I must have been like so close to hitting him that it considered him hit when he was invulnerable again. Bro! What? This time I ground pound him though, he's not above a hole. Why? Okay, I thought I was dead. <laughs> yeah, I can see! At least we started down here. Oh boy. This is crazy. This is one of the craziest boss fights I've ever seen. You don't have to let me get away. You think I wouldn't master upside down this? Because I really can't do it. You're only upside down long enough that doing all the shit you could do to see right side up isn't worth the effort. It was in a really hard spot to ground pound. I think I got him. This one's not so bad, I kinda like this one. I gotta be ready to get it after five bombs though. Dude, I thought for sure he'd come towards me.
You can get him. I keep side flipping first. There we go. Did that not count? Oh no, it must have counted. Dude! What? <laughs> Alright, I'll go further away. Wait! Are you not gonna shoot me again? Bro, you are the world's biggest cheater. It's gonna kill me. Ground pound him? Yeah, I tried. I hit him, but I also took damage. That time I just sucked. I didn't even notice. Dive into him? No. He never made a sound effect until I started ground pounding him, so I'm gonna stick with the ground pounds. I tried punching and other alternatives first. Damn it. Getting a ground pound sucks, so I'd, trust me when I say I would not want this to be my first option. Oh my god, disorienting. Let's go, the creator of the game told me the most effective way to battle him, and now I'm voting a 9. Out of pettiness. No, dude, they get me every time with the mix-up. I fucking love that sound effect, it's so funny to me. Oh yeah, I should back up a bunch. I think once it starts going high speed, it needs more room to make it back to the ground. I think that's why it exploded last time. I like hit it before it was no longer airborne. Yeah, that did not happen last time. Are you disappearing? Oh, tea bagged. Balls on head. Oh my God, that was sick. That takes care of that. Hurry, let's go and check on Zelda. That sounds like Vic. Anybody else? Princess Zelda, are you okay? I'm doing just fine. Thank you, Eros. And you. You must be Mario. Let's go. I appreciate all you've done to come and rescue me. The royal family is forever in your death. I'll turn the game up, sorry. Taking care of body was effortless for Mario. You should have seen him. Good to know we have such a capable hero on our side. You have my gratitude. She is huge, what the fuck? <laughs> She's well, three Marios! Say our goodbyes. Let's lead you back home, Mario. Let's go. Alright, please vote on this. This was, in my opinion, a masterpiece. I love this credit sequence. Everything about this was so good. Goddamn. Janja modeled? What did Janja model, she's been? I'm paying attention to chat. Credits remind you of Mario World? I can see that vibe. I can agree with that.
I like this song a lot too. YouTube Squad, sure. <laughs> I like the walking backwards title suggestion. Script and dialogue. Vic Turcor was a voice in this game? Vic, you didn't tell me that you did voice acting? I thought we were bros. Holy shit. Uh, please vote if you haven't, by the way. To vote, all you do is type a number in chat, one through 10, and uh, it'll automatically record your vote. Please vote if you did not. Vic, can you publish that video? S and D B B did some help too. I did notice that. I don't I don't recognize their voice because I don't think I've ever heard it, but I did notice that. What a thick hack. Make sure to check out Yoshi Commits Tax Fraud 64, my major hack releasing soon. Flash technique. <laughs> And also Danganronpa64, coming to an N64 near you. True, true. Well damn, these credits were quite nice. What's left on the spreadsheet? Oh shit. Mario's about to get some or what? Nah, he's gone. Sexy. <laughs> So much about playing in my game. Oh, what a fucking joyous credits. What a great hack. Alright, let me see the spreadsheet here. I have Scuttlebug Razor's hack left, who I will not be playing today. Uh, they requested that I play their hack on EverDrive. I tried finding the cable to do that today. I can't find it. I only owned one of them, so I bought a few of those. So, in a couple days when I receive that cable, I will play Scuttlebug Razor's Hack on EverDrive. Uh, until I get that mini HDMI or whatever it's called. We'll have to delay that one. There's two hacks left. Technically, there's four. But I think two of them have been, uh, pre-disqualified and one of them isn't even a hack of Mario 64. So, those are being done last, those are just bonus for funsies after we voted on everything else. Which means they're not happening today. There's two real hacks left, one by Wise Guy, one by Lawn Chairs, and one that uh, still needs review, I guess. But, today I'm gonna go ahead with Wise Guy's hack, Legend of Mario, Star Sealed Castle. I'm gonna load that up. You wouldn't count out the non-SM64 one? Well, that's why we don't leave you in charge of making decisions around here, because this is a Mario 64 ROM hack competition. Uh, let's see, line 49. Ooh, look at this screen. Make sure we close that poll already. Thank you guys so much for voting on the last one. 410 votes is awesome participation. And I fucking full screen. Get me out of here. I'm gonna restart my emulator real quick just to fix any potential issues that will arise as a result of me not restarting my emulator real quick. So that is how this worked. <laughs> Alright, so just again, uh, this is Legend of Mario Star Sealed Castle by Wise Guy. Should be cool. Uh, a little bit of trivia about the guy who made this game, Wise Guy. I do see him talk sometimes in the SM64 ROM hack discussion channel of my Discord. And while this does sound like an ad, I'm mostly gonna say, I don't hate Wise Guy. He doesn't seem like an asshole. That's my review. Oh my god, look at this fucking menu. What an asshole. Let's go. Dear Mario, you must make your way to Toe Town and see me. Something is terribly wrong at the castle, and it's the work of Bowser. Patch. Sounds good.
Fuck. At the last second, at the very last second of that loading screen, I thought about pausing my emulator and pretending that it was like a 45 second longer loading screen. The moment I thought about the joke, uh, it stopped being a loading screen, so unfortunate. Holy shit, this is insane! <laughs> Thank you for coming so quickly, Mario, but we have no time for pleasantries. Bowser has stolen the power of the stars again and used their magic to seal the castle in an unbreakable barrier! Not all hope is lost, however, as this Toad believes there may be a way to lift the barrier. Alright, Toad, well tell me what you think. New camera. First of all, putting that out there. Very smooth looking camera. These little talking indicators. Love that. Never seen that in a Mario hack, even though it's just, like, I just love new shit. Hello Mario, I'm Sam RT. Nice. And you'd better listen up. The barrier looks strong, but is no ma- His fucking head is gyrating back and forth. <laughs> but it's no match for the power of the super blocks. <laughs> These artifacts are scattered across the Mushroom Kingdom and will give you the strength to smash the barrier. As if it were glass. There's three of them in total and legend has it that the first one is at the top of the volcano in Hotfoot Ruins. The path seems to be blocked, so I hope you brought your hammer. Come find me again after you find that super block. We'll do, we'll do, we'll do. Dude, this camera is so different. Holy shit. I heard there were distant lands out there beyond the Mushroom Kingdom and even more beyond that. Have you ever wondered what's out there, Mario? No? Oh, wow, this has full up and down as well. Well... That is... That's pretty wild. Between you and me, Mario, I don't think I've ever seen anyone grow something in this spot. I'm a pro gardener, not even I could do it. You'd need magic seeds to grow something here. Who believes anything like that? Only someone as dumb as Plan T, my brother, who... My brother would believe in that. There's a reason he couldn't inherit the family business. Damn. I didn't know the family business was being an asshole. Because you're an expert. <laughs> Why does Bowser always mess with Peach? Doesn't... My mouth's in the way. Doesn't he know any other princesses c he could pick on? Just what we needed. A giant immovable block. Who even put this thing here? True, true. And these toads look like they're fucking HD high def or what? What? It must just be the small idle animation that does so much for it. But there is something that just looks different about them as well. I can't believe you're actually talking to me. You'd think that the great Mario would be too busy to talk to a measly toad, but you made the time. Shouldn't you be saving the kingdom, though? Okay, well, this is why I don't talk to the measly toads, because they're constantly tossing shade. Meanwhile, I haven't seen them ever prevent the princess from being kidnapped, which is all they do. Hey, Mario, welcome to my minigame house. I've got a wicked game for you to try. You'll need a hammer to play. You can borrow this one, but it's my only one, so you better give it back. Awesome. L to swing it, okay. Maybe the minigame toad won't notice if you walk off with it. I don't know what else he'd notice if not me walking away, but. Okay, you can hold it, or you can tap it. Interesting. Didn't even play the minigame. What minigame? Wait a second, Mario, you don't have any money? This ain't a charity, no games for you. You'd better put that hammer back where you found it. Are you even listening? I'm gonna, I'm gonna put you to put it back where I found it, bitch. <laughs> I can't cross the counter as that is uh, forbidden in RPGs. Everyone knows that. If you cross the counter anyway, then they'll give you weird looks. Are you guys familiar with trying to shop from the wrong side of, a uh, in Super Mario RPG, I think this is the game. The great Mario has graced my shop with this presence. My name's Plenty, I hope you're not expecting a discount. I've got to make a living too, and I can't just go around breaking blocks like you. Besides, I'm all out of inventory at the moment, so I don't have anything to sell you. Maybe come back. But yeah, in, a. Uh, in Mario RPG, if you go to a shop and jump over the counter before you talk to them, that's some shit about, like, 
It's like real passive aggressive. It's like, good job, Mario. <laughs> How about trying the other side or something like that? Get me out of here. Your first trial will test your strength. Only the powerful have the fortitude to survive the scorching heat of hot foot rooms. Get fucked. The foes carved into the rock know the correct order to open the way. Their images cannot speak, but they can count. There's foes carved into rock? What does that mean? True. Well, in the midst of your, uh, whatever that was, message, I pictured only one frog to answer your question, and it's this cool orange frog from a show I just finished called Dead Like Me. Now, I don't know what kind of frog that is, but I'm sure it can be googled. Probably pretty easily. Holy fuck! Chill the fuck out! Okay, I can get hit by the boulder, sure. Did this guy know you made Fall Guys before Fall Guys? Fuck! Get me up here. Do you guys have health? I know, what a nice pause screen. I hadn't seen it before. The coins do just give me health again. There were a lot of times in the last game I just played where coins not giving me health were was weird to me. I think it was a, a decision that made perfect sense, but it was still weird. Like, to be used to it, I mean. Really? Why? That seems so deliberate. I guess it isn't, though. Wait, I just want to BLJ up the Montimo path. It's not even that fucking crazy. Just let me do it. All right, there we go. That's an alignment. 11 jumps and I'm out. Ah, uh, fuck. I'm afraid of accidentally exiting too. We'll just go with this shitty speed here. <laughs> That's a bit harsh, don't you think? Wow. <laughs> That is so harsh. I just got used to checkpoints and shit. I mean, that's how it should be. That's how every Mario hack is. I don't know why I expected anything different. I just got spoiled by a, a game that babied me. Yeah. All right, well, enough fucking around then. This isn't baby hour. I mean, I guess what idiot would fall off here, if not no one? Huh. Well, I don't exactly know which way I'd like to go first, but... Oh well. This camera's a bit to get used to. Huh. Okay. Yeah, this camera's a little bit weird to get used to, but I have to imagine for 
someone getting into Mario 64 or someone who is relatively new to Mario 64, they would probably love this camera. Because it is just better, it seems. Like, it is just more noob-friendly, I think. What are these? I see them everywhere. I must not have something I can use here later. Okay. Sure. Dev is trying to get me to change glide version. Yeah, I can do that. I only have one other version though. Oh, almost forgot the save state. That would have sucked. That would have been ball sex. The pause sh screen should have orange buttons. Okay. Well, I hope that's the case when I load this. Ah, that makes more sense. You need a key to open this door. Don't yell at me ever again. I can't actually get over there, can I? Surely not, not based on that. You can't sidle this, like, what do we think this is? This is... This... Oh, there's a power-up where I turn tiny? Is that what- is that what it is? <laughs> is that real? Oh, shit. I saw that hole earlier in the side of the building, but, you know, it was a one-off thing, so I didn't know what to think of it. Got a key. Evening, boss man. How are we doing? These hacks are looking mind blowing. I'm doing pretty good, thank you, Boso. Evening, boss man. How are we doing? These hacks are looking mind blowing. There have been some really good hacks today. I started off with the best one, but there have been some really good ones just all day. Momentum patch. Normally when you long jump off a rising platform like that, that doesn't happen. I got the Minish Cap. That's fucking funny. It lets you shrink down in size. The M on it stands for Minish, the Z, UZ, blah, blah, blah. You can only shrink when standing on a Minish portal, look for objects. Got it. Yo, what up? I'm just small Mario! So you must be a goddamn menace at this size, right? Nah, not quite. For a, a power-up like this? Jesus, let me up! Bro, don't you see how small I am? Uh, I was gonna say, for a power-up like this, the uh, camera, Seems, like, mandatory. Uh... What? Bro! This is hard as fuck! Maybe I can try the hold A and run forward with B approach? Nope, that is a mistake. I can't control ant size Mario on rotating platform. You have to be a fucking in insane player to do this. <laughs> that is hard as hell. <laughs> Fuck that. This is like the most non-obstacle for Big Mario as well. Triple jump? Yeah, I was trying. Hammer time, dude. Damn it, I wasn't ready. Fuck. Please do- Oh, yeah! True! I'm all the way back to the beginning! I got fucked! I got... I got fucked. Like, that was fucked. It shouldn't have taken me that many tries to begin with. That... that's the attempt I landed on. But I did get fucked.
Ah, god damn, dude. <laughs> god damn it. <laughs> I wanted to pause the buffer. I just wanted to make sure I'd be running the right direction. I just wanted an extra couple seconds in life to think. Dude, what is that weenie ass long jump? I didn't go anywhere. God. <laughs> I'm dead. I'm mad. You know what I think would be really cool? That fucking ball was insane. Um... I am liking the different cameras coming out. But it would be cool if, like... People started having it as an option. I don't even know if that's possible because when you change like something as mechanical as how the camera works, I don't know that you can just toggle between the two. I'm not a ROM hacker, dude. I just play games. You know, I just get dumber by the day. <laughs> but it would be cool if you could choose what camera style you want to use. I think... I, I don't think not having that detracts from this hack in any way. I just think it would be cool if hack creators started doing that, just in general. Cause there are a lot of different skill level players and I think the majority of people benefit from oops, cameras like this, but not everybody. Mini Mario platform was missed. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of stuff in the town. Um, but I don't want to get all the extra shit in the town at the moment. I'm gonna have to go back there later. I might as well finish this first. Let's go. Landed the triple jump this time. Dude, these things suck balls. I can't hit them. Oh, it's because only this one is breakable. <laughs> I suck balls, not the game. Fuck, now the game sucks balls again. <laughs> I top up, up, up. Dude, it's a it's a it's a trick. It's a it's a it's a fucking trick. Am I too close? Am I too far? Like That's that's bullshit is what it is. That's a trick. It's it's a trickery at its finest. Oh man, I can't even simple flips my way up there. I'm in a game over again. I don't know if I want a game over again. It's the middle one, I bet. <sighs> the middle one had bombs above it. No, it is that one the whole time. It doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Look at the faces, King. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> fuck you. I looked at the faces. <laughs> I tried hitting that one so many times. Wait, don't tell me. Oh, dude. To what end? Was I never supposed to become big again? Why did you put the small thing there? I have half a heart. I don't even know if I can get back down there without dying. I probably can, but you know. For, for the sake of being dramatic, I'm mad. At least now all the blocks are broken. I bet if I was small Mario the entire time, a thing that, that did not suggest necessary, this would have been easy as fuck. How could you miss?
What's that platform doing out of bounds? This isn't what order did you see these random things on the wall, is it? Bombs were last. These were... Maybe before the Goombas? It's the number of them? Oh no. I now see what this is out of bounds for. And there's a cool looking block there. Dude. There were two bomb bombs on the one we saw. And I think I saw four Goombas earlier, but I did not see these other things at all. Hammer? I think they're the same. This is like based off Paper Mario and... Hammering and jumping on them were the same. You think you need to hit them in ascending order? That would be a much, 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 much easier to guess. If it's hitting them in like ascending order, then we know that this would be two. Tromps, I'm pretty sure, are three, and Goombas are four. I don't. I, I never saw a Pokey on the wall. You guys actually saw a Pokey on the wall? And then it was... I know I saw three of these motherfuckers, and I'm pretty sure I saw four of these. So we can guess five. Six, seven. If, assume, if we assume that we're right about everything else... Um... Then this should be pretty easy to brute force. We could say this is five, this is six, and this is seven. How do you reset? I assume it just works if you do it correctly. <clears throat> there was five Goombas? Ah, oh, fuck. The level's not that hard, I could run through it and actually pay attention. Let me... Uh, uh, leave the room to reset. It's not even a different loading zone. I'm just gonna dive here. I'm just gonna do it the way it's intended instead of guessing for half an hour and then doing it the way it's intended. Alright, this was the sign. The foes carved into the rock know the correct order to open the way. Their images cannot speak, but they can count. Okay. It's just a matter of finding them. I wasn't even looking for them, and I saw plenty of them without even looking. I just hope there's... I mean, we don't need to find all of them, because we can assume things about a couple of them. I'm gonna open a little notepad. It's not how many Goombas there are in the stage, guys. I'm almost certain of it. There are random carvings of different things in the walls. I'll, I'll show you an example, and then maybe you'll be like, Oh! Oh, fuck me, dude. If there's a... There's something down there that's stupid. Dude, you know I suck balls. I cannot get past these rocks. I can get hit... Twice more, and I honestly don't think it's enough. <laughs> Alright. Oh, there's a ghost small thing here now. It's not just the ones in the town, there was an extra one here. Okay, well, let's see this. There's probably a hint here. But we know. 
Four moles. Four moles. Which means the Goombas was probably five. Does that mean hit the mole fourth? I'm gonna assume that that's what that means, yeah. If it doesn't mean that, then I have no idea. Is there anything over here? Should I not be tiny anymore? Oh shit, there's one Pokey. Okay, so we know Pokey's first. One Pokey. I, I, didn't, I never saw this before. You guys might have seen that, but I did not notice it. Okay. And I'm pretty sure I remember two bombs. Don't tell me, dude. How astronomically ass to not let me go through this door as a tiny idiot. Fuck it. Don't jump at all. Land in the lava. Fuck it. Fuck it. Just get fucked. Dude, being an ant would suck balls. I, I really think, I really think I mean that. Okay, just making sure there's nothing on the walls in here I didn't notice. Just talk to the door. Getting hit while small being an insta-kill would be a, honestly a pretty cool feature. Even though it's so easy to get hit in this game. So down here, there was like, that's five Goombas down there. Five Goombas. Shit. Shit times two. And then that's the three chomps I knew about. So we're, we basically already have enough to solve this puzzle. Three chomps, I know there was two bombs. I can guess the other two if I don't just see them on my way over here. I don't know where the fire thing is, but I guess it doesn't matter. And I don't even remember what the other enemy was by now. Oh my god, it's so hard. Three chain chumps, yep, I got that written down. Six beetles. Yeah, it's either uh, six beetles or six fires. Fuck, that's hard. Dude, I, I suck! Just triple jump. No! I hate this! Alright, one more try, I guess. It's over. It's impossible! Fuck! Try not to dive. Yeah, no shit, buddy. Well, maybe I'll find the things as I run all the way back. No, I run into that so much. It does not look like a solid wall that's right next to me. But it is. Quick save next time. Save state, you mean? 
I could have done that. But uh, if I safe stated there, I wouldn't have felt any pressure to be a better player. And I think that that's more important than the fact that I have to now run back. Yeah, but if I load the save, it's not gonna bring me back here. You guys never play a Zelda game? It's not like it's gonna bring me anywhere different than when I died. Anything on the back wall with the archway to the money moles? Uh, I actually did check there. That, that, I thought that would be a really good spot to hide something too. I like where your mind is. Let's go, I got two triple jumps that time. <gasps> Bitch, what? Come on, dude, don't. If I somehow am here long enough to die. Okay, we're good. Wait, I wanna try this as a tiny marsupial. Okay, I just have to do it far in advance, I think. Otherwise, the hitbox maybe goes past, past it. And then I gotta be small again. Just to verify, that was two bombs behind that platform. Two bombs. Yeah, th that's exactly what I have down for my note speeds. I'm almost certain I'll just guess the last one and it won't be an issue. Oh god, Jesus. It just would've been cool to see the other ones. Like, I didn't look for them super hard knowing that I could just solve the puzzle, but it would've been cool to find them anyway. There's three more? I think there's only two more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I only have to guess one fifty fifty. So it was one pokey, two bombs, three of these guys, four moles, not five, and five Goombas, not four. And the other ones were literally not in consideration. They were just bonus. That's why I never found them. Okay. Makes sense. That sucks, that means I hella could have guessed it before. Incredible strength rushes into you. Let's go. Those red herrings were the difference between me just trying to brute force it. So, good job, I guess. You must break the barrier and recover. Okay, Peach, come on, I'm fucking working on it. You don't have anything else to talk about. Great job getting the first super block, Mario. While you were on your climb, I looked into the location of the next one. It turns out that it's actually right here in Toad Town. Well, technically it's under Toad Town in the sewers, but hey, that's your specialty, right? Now, if only we could find a way down there. Sorry, Mario, but my toilet's clogged. I did see a storm drain nearby, though. You are not helpful. I'll just put that out there. Kinda, though. You know, I take it back, Toad, I'm sorry. There's a shrink thing somewhere in this town. I remember maybe seeing one earlier. Is it under you? Ow. Oh. Nope, I'm just dumb. Yep, I'm blind. Oh shit, I tried a long jump. Damn, I thought that said I hop before I realized that was an S. And I was getting pretty excited about bacon and pancakes. To what fucking end would you want to come back here? Oh, there's a real cool bonus room. It's not like... <laughs> okay. Now talk to the door. I'll knock on it. Hold on, hold on. 
Your establishment is haunted! <laughs> Progress gated content. Yeah, that's my guess as well. Can I go in here? Aw, oh, man. Dude, look how fast... You swim. Actually, I should say, look how fast it looks like I'm swimming, because I don't know if... This might just be normal speed, but I look like I'm schmoovin'. <laughs> I don't have the invis cap, but I'm tiny. Wow, nice hammer, Mario. How... how can you see my hammer? Oh, there it is. This is it right here, a bit. Your next try will test your wisdom. Do you have the knowledge to navigate these deep, damp catacombs? I don't know, dude. But, I will say this. You try and pull that puzzle shit again on me? That'll be your last puzzle, buddy. <laughs> you get one puzzle pass, bruh. <laughs> Quiz time. <laughs> that would be the next natural progression. Okay. A lot of different ways I can maybe get up here. Is this a down? Huh. Can't tell if cheese or if dream. I'm gonna try and not cheese this. Oh. I'm gonna go down here first. I feel like there's a, you know, progression staple here. Well, that's really cool looking. Oh, I got a key. Well, only someone who was fucking insane would ever climb out of that. <laughs> no, thank you. If I go back and have zero keys, I'm gonna be really upset. Yeah, that's what I like to see. Dumbass. There is a lot of custom stuff in this hack, I agree. But maybe I was supposed to come up here then. That looks a little bit too long to be doing wall kicks on over here. I feel like that's uninviting. I think this is the way I'm intended to go, to be honest. He used. You need a key! Okay. Pretty linear path so far. In terms of where I actually need to go. I guess it's not linear in the way it looks. There's not five of y'all, right? Waiting to get... ram ranched. Dude! Why- why the tiny platforming? <laughs> why the platforming for tiny people if I'm supposed to not be tiny right now? Fuck. Am I gonna be okay? I think so, I feel good. I'm- I'm having a good day. Ooh, look at this custom camera angle. The god! I like this. Dude. Bummer. Why am I going backwards? I was going backwards? When did I start going backwards? Shit. I don't feel like I was going backwards at all. But Vic did ask me if I was okay. 
And he doesn't normally ask that, so maybe I was going backwards? Oh, when I was messing with the piranha plants? That does make sense. Yeah. No, uh... The way piranha plants work in Vanilla Mario is if you kill all five of them, a star spawns somewhere. You know, so I wanted to make sure that if there were five of them, I at least kill them. That's due diligence. I still feel like I sh should be killing them. I just didn't mean to jump into the goo as many times as I did. And I honestly blame that on the different camera. I'm not really a goosh mover, otherwise. This camera is a little bit hard for me to get used to. Uh, not that I think it makes the heck bad or anything, it doesn't. This is a me problem. I do like this camera though, for this wall kick section. That is a very interesting color for a, a ceiling there, or a roof. <sighs> Remove speed kicks. Can you believe that thing moved the moment I went to engage with that enemy? That's that shit in Mario Maker 1. I don't know if it's still a thing in 2. Where they... They make a platform look like it's on a track, so when it turns at the last second and you die, you have no idea it's coming. You remember having a 162 bishop in Maple Story? That's probably really sick. I've only ever had a bishop that moved diagonally. That's it. But you do get two of them. You get the magic shell. Press R to activate it. Enjoy some smooth sailing. The shell uses magic. Magic regenerates when not in use. Okay. That's exactly like the magic cape. Oh. Okay. I maybe should have made sure there wasn't more stuff in the up direction before I jumped down, but that's okay. I'll peep it real quick. Looks like there's nothing really up there. I see a bat. He can stay up there. Oh, two bats. They're actually keys, if uh, you didn't know. Ow. Okay, so I come back here when I get a key. Got it, got it, got it. Okay. Fuck. I didn't really want to slide out the way I did, to be fair. Keys <laughs> my ass. I, I dig it. I dig the joke, dude. Whoa! Chill! How crazy would it be if you could get back on before you hit the ground and do like some infinite magic shit? Don't know why that's what I'm thinking about right now, but it was what I was thinking about right now. the issue is Mario's I can't tell where I am Mario's jump height is so fucking crazy compared to its size I can't tell what I'm doing I can't side flip here I fucking suck. Yes! 
I was there long enough to side flip. I saw what it looked like. Dude, if I punch, that's just enough to... One punch forward is more than half of this platform. How am I supposed to do a jump here? <laughs> look at look how far one punch is sending me. Backflip? That's actually not the worst idea. <sighs> Mario's so fast. For the person who said backflip, that was a decent idea. VIP? I'm gonna VIP the guy that said backflip second. Because he said it differently. Sorry, first backflip guy. Sometimes the first guy isn't meant to win every single time. This is one of those cases. That is damn, but think about it this way. Holy shit, so much speed. Think about how every person who said it t second felt. Now it's their time to win. Finally, these noobs are rewarded for being slow typers. Oh, is this not where I'm meant to be right now? Was I supposed to get a E or something? Maybe there was more to that room and I'm dumb. If you said backflip second, what would you have won? I would have finally given you what you wanted this entire time. <laughs> Prompt ban. Maybe I go back to the beginning area and there's some shit? I don't know- oh! There it is. I'm blind as all day. If I can swim into this tiny hole, I will be rewarded with whatever that item is. Crystal room? No thank you. I can see clear- clearly that there's nothing down there. Get me off this corner, dude. I'm so sick of being tiny. Oh fuck, I'm going back. <laughs> Why did I think it would be anything but the key? Why did I think I would get it and leave? Of course it's the key, that's obvious. I just didn't think about it. Tiny Mario is a good idea. There were, uh, there was a moment where I was playing normal Mario or normal ROM hacks that already existed as small Mario. And, uh, I played the original, I think I played Star Road and Green Stars, and I look back at all of those as just the worst experience of all time. I am so over controlling Tiny Mario who still has normally sized jumps and shit. And controlling Giant Mario is no better, but it's not necessarily worse either. Are you joking? What is this? This is Microsoft music? That's pretty cool. What if... The mid-air double jump? Yeah, it doesn't work in here. Alright, I guess I'm doing this again. I don't know if I needed to do that, but maybe I needed to do that. Uh, maybe? I don't think so. I don't know what the small shit's for, but I doubt I'm platforming as a tiny idiot here. These probably just don't kill you. They do kill me, so I literally nothing I understand is real. Shell time? I guess, huh? I fucking have to shmoog so hard! Wait, there was a star for killing all five of them! You fuckers didn't know anything! But now my camera's broken! Oh no, dude, that was a bug. I'm almost certain of it. I don't think you were meant to kill all five of them. Because my camera's fucked now. And my camera wouldn't be fucked right now if I had- Oh wait, I think if I die it fixes it. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, okay. That's a bug? I knew it. I, then I won't go collect the star. I got you. I knew that was unintentional. I could fucking taste it, dude. That's exactly why I was killing those piranhas earlier. Everyone thought I was drunk and stupid, but I just know everything about the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
I just don't know how to play it. I did it at the wrong spot? I didn't. This is where he decided to put the fifth piranha. That star is probably long gone out of bounds with... I am a genius. I just know everything. I just do. <laughs> I was gonna say that star is probably out of bounds somewhere because it's very unlikely that the creator of this hack would have set a proper destination for it. That, where that star is is probably zero zero. If I had to guess. You bitch ass motherfucker, you killed five piranhas, didn't you? That would be a very funny message. No way they'll get all five. Ooh, a little slide? What is that over there? There's something on the wall over there. Is that a tiny hole for a tiny version of Mario? It looks like it, doesn't it? Shit, alright. Please bring me back up. Okay. Oh, tiny perspective is so scary. <laughs> I can't. Oh wait, I can, but I, it's harder. Okay. Dude, this hole looked so fucking small from far away. Okay, I think small Mario is now supposed to swim through that hole. I hope there was no bonus on top, because I... I could still technically go up there. I don't think it'll ever, ever be worth the effort, because I'd have to lower the water again. Mario's ass isn't so big when he's small. It's not the size of the ass, Mark. It's, uh, I almost called you Mario. It's not the size of Mario's ass, Mark. It's how you use it. <laughs> Mark is Mario confirmed. Arcane knowledge fills your mind. Take me out of here. I've been loving this hack so far. This and the hack before it have both been really fun to play. All right, before I get figuring out where I need to go next, I need to see if there's a purpose for this now. Shit. Here, I'll talk to you though. I heard there were distant lands out there beyond the Mushroom Kingdom and even more beyond that. No, no, there isn't. You know what? It makes sense. I, for some reason, thought it wouldn't matter. There's gotta be something in that house. Is that a magic bean? Did I just find the big magic bean? You got a magic bean. Find somewhere to plant it and it may end up growing into something interesting. Okay, so I think... I think the last thing I have to do is gonna be in the sky on a giant beanstalk, which is, a uh, perfectly fine. Do I need a watering can as well? Maybe I need to be big, big Mario. Talk to this guy. Between you and me, Mario, I don't think... Yeah, 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 yeah. 
I love the spamming button noise. Oh! Fuck! Your final trial will test your courage. The stronghold was built to measure the determination of a true hero. Will you be able to conquer the elements and emerge victorious? Nope. I wanted to talk to the other people in the town. <laughs> I wanted to see if they said anything different. Could you hurry up with removing the barrier? Wow, what a dick. I'm gonna check the shop too. See if that's any different now that there's progression. Recover the bars from Boozer. Back already, Mario. Good work. I'll try to ignore the putrid scent coming off you for the moment. I've got something important to tell you, Mario. This last super block isn't going to be easy because it's in the sky. Have you ever heard of the Rainbow Palace? It's a legendary floating castle high up in the clouds. Our ancestors built it using the power... Sorry, I read that wrong. Our ancestors built it using the, the power of the stars in order to guard the last super block. I'd get you a wing cap, but I left mine in the castle. Maybe plenty could... Has something you could buy to help out. Okay, so that's a hint. I already found the magic bean. I want to see if there's a mini game in here. Wait a second, Mario. True, true. All right, we're climbing. After we talk to one more toad. I'm a total klutz. I dropped the keys to the sewer down the drain, and now there's no way to get down there. Well, not unless I can find a way to shrink. Oh, well, I doubt anyone needs to get down there anytime soon. Besides, I heard the sewer is haunted. Okay. I do like the call to action for Luigi, but me and him aren't really on speaking terms anymore. And I can't really get into why. Can I make this? The answer is no. I can't make it. The, the fact that I made it was a miracle. I will not make this jump. Oh, no. Don't strand me here. That was the minigame, not the shop guy. I already went to the shop and found the, uh... I found the magic bean already, so I didn't bother going back. Wow, these things are easy when, uh... Never mind. Oh shit, I like how far down that goes. That's a cool detail. No, dude, do not put me next to Blowy Joey's. This is my nightmare. I'm so embarrassed. Whenever this happens to me! It's so stupid. I don't know how to avoid these because there's never been training on how to avoid these because no one's ever needed to avoid these. And time! I'm a genius. What's going on up there? Okay. Uh, get away from me! Am I just supposed to go there first? Do I go? I'm going here. What is this? <laughs> oh no. Hammer. I forgot I had a hammer. No. Fuck me! I forgot I had a hammer! I lost my checkpoint as well, so I might as well get full health. Alright. Okay. Sure. 
Just do the BL. Oh, the BJ skip, even better. Yeah, I won't do that. I think if I stand like right here, I get Blowy Joe'd over there. I'm not a Facebook uh, streamer anymore, Felicity, so you wouldn't ever want to uh, follow over there. I mean, support over there. I hate this so much. Hate is a strong word. I've always had a disdain for these enemies, dude. I've always been terrified of them. Maybe if you're just in the air, it can't get you. I will use my confirmation bias to declare that as truth. I'm gonna smash the window. God damn it. I hated how much of a possibility that was. Why? What yonder wind breaks if not this window? Well, maybe I can just do this and get back at least. Dude, you guys want me to come back up here twice? I don't feel like I could reasonably get over here as small Mario. Unless there's a small thing up there and I can jump into a tornado. Is this room connected to the other rooms in any way? Heck! Wait, don't, don't do that. I still think it should let me keep my checkpoint, but I think what really went wrong there is I just wasn't meant to go over there yet. Thanks, Felicity, for the $10. I appreciate that. I appreciate the support. Even though you did uwu, which a little questionable. Go away, bitch. You're a bitch. Maybe that's not where I go. Maybe I go straight up there and first. Can I enter more than once? I'm gonna get zucchini, dude, fuck. Dude, this thing is a goddamn menace. I don't know where to go. <laughs> I guess I'll try and get over there small, but good luck. The fact that I made this jump seem like a miracle. There's no way I have to make it small. There's just no way. It's not possible. <laughs> Confirmation bias is working. Maybe I was supposed to go all the way down there to that other window. It's, it doesn't seem like I can make it to any other thing without getting kaput. Even when I ground pound, I can't avoid the thing. Oh, I dodged the fucking thing. This is the greatest enemy in Mario history. It's never been this good. They fucking modified him to suck extra balls. <laughs> Ah, 
Alright, I just won't spawn it. New stretch? No. What can I do? <laughs> you have to be a goddamn wizard! Okay, I'm good. I hope so. I really do. But I don't know. These things are much less of a concern. Like, good luck ever hitting me with one of those. As, a po uh, as opposed to the other one being just completely unavoidable. There it is, that's the answer. I don't know what the point is of having that small thing down there. Other than to, like, trick you into thinking you're ever... That's fine. That's fine. Doesn't matter that my jump sucked. Yeah, I meant to say opposed, but I use a lot of syllables up here, you know? Three hours go by, do you know how many different syllables I've said in three hours? Sometimes I misspeak. Wait, is this not the end? Okay. I thought I fucking imagined that gap there and it wasn't real. I got the rock's feather! I have an extra jump! After the apex of a triple jump, I can jump again. Holding A longer makes your extra jump go higher. Use a dive to jump further than ever. Oh shit. What? <laughs> Let's go. Now I understand, it's because you have to get out again. You probably will want to be normal size again. Really? Now, I actually am super okay with it, because I jumped without halting my momentum whatsoever, so I could get- f so I could die and have full health. Um... That just isn't how I expected that to go. Same result, desired effect, not what I wanted. <laughs> Completely not my intention. Oh my god, look at this room. Dude, no one ever uses the, uh, the dash emoji. Nice to see one out in the wild. Alright, bring me here. I have no idea what this music is, and I like it. Okay, so now I have triple jump magic. Wow. I'll be Shmario and pretty massively now. What's my inspiration? Oh! True! Alright. I like it. Like, do a floor. Fix the elevator, probably. Those are not things that you can jump off of, by the way. That's what you have to do. Also, I don't want to just gloss over how cool of an enemy that is. I think those things are in Mario Galaxy. I wouldn't know because I've never played, but... If I was a, a small child, I probably would play that game. Well, a little baby, I'd play it. Actually, maybe they're from Odyssey? Because I remember in the Sand Kingdom, something that does basically this, but they might have been in both. Oh, okay. That's a lot of health to lose. Okay, I, I'm not super optimistic that I'm getting this on this attempt. But I did talk a lot of shit, and that was that was pretty nice. I did. I did generalize a lot of things. <laughs> Felt good. Oh, I landed right on it! Mama 
I was so close. I would have had to go all the way back though, I think. This level might end up being hard as balls. Music here is fucking aggressive. I don't know any other way to describe it. I mean, I would describe it as cool, too, I guess, but it is very aggro. Let's go. First lock, disengage. Activate remaining switch to access basement floor three. Yes, I don't have to go all the way back. That's what I was mostly annoyed by. The idea of having to go all the way back. That's so good. Not having to go all the way back. Oh my god. This is very Zelda-y, I will say. <laughs> Smashed. I hit the wrong button. Do you think I can use the shell here? I don't think I'd be able to get back up. It looks like it's everything's too low to jump back up. Menace! Thickhead! That's a shock zone anyway. I only have two hearts left. I'm gonna need coins if I find them. No. Fuck it. Alright, is there health anywhere? Okay, I'm boned. I just have to make it to the end. Patience and dodging this guy. That's all I need. That's all I need to wor worry about. And breathing. And fine dining. Alright, new, new strategy. You literally can't get me. That was so stupid. That was so stupid to expect that to work. You just have to wait until I'm ready to play Galaxy. That's really all anyone can do. You'll donate? I don't want to play it yet. So don't donate. <laughs> I'm not ready to play it. You'll know when I'm ready to play it. I got other shit I want to do before I play games I don't want to play. I got a bunch of games I don't want to play. I have to play. Sometimes it's hard to even remember that I'm playing a compact when I play a hack like this. Oh my god, these do a full fucking damage. It's way less fine than I thought. That's fine, though. For a different reason, it's fine. I know where to get some health. Oh, it gives me full health after I tell you. Okay, good. They are extremely Zelda-themed. Also, it doesn't have to be exactly Zelda for it to be a Zelda-inspired hack.
I will say this alone made me think of Forest Temple. This is exactly what you do in Forest Temple, although the feeling is uh, not moving that quickly and the ground there is checkered, but like, you know, it's the same shit. Don't get squished. This is some chips challenge sound and music, dude. I, the way the thing is shaking sporadically is fucking with my brain. Gimme. You love chips challenge? I like it too, but I've never full cleared. Chips challenge. Yo, what up? Huh. Okay, so I restored the the yellow power. Is the uh, conclusion I can draw from that? That in itself is very, very Zelda-like. You know, Ganon's castle and stuff. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Didn't know I would be jumping off my shell there. I like this. I can combine this. Oh, that's a wall. I was like, why the fuck did my shell just break? Like, I was ready to make that jump to the next one. Like, I was gonna move so hard, you have no idea. Oh, epic. I didn't know they respawn. That's crazy, too. Damn it. This makes sense, being the fire challenge. Fuck! That was just me being bad, not reading ahead. Ah, uh, okay, okay, I got this. This is a little anti schmove Okay. Ah, I missed that one somehow! Jesus! Boom. I love levels like that, dude. You can get behind that all day. Uh, let's restore power to the blue one. That is such a fun level. Environments like that are so fun. Huh. This is cool. Blue gonna suck? My immediate thought was that as well, but this is... This is already a really cool area. I'm sure it's just gonna be a collapsed version of the dungeon from earlier, though. Don't eat me. Nice. Okay, there's some small mini shit happening. Uh, what is this for? The secret? What? Why is there- there's no stars to collect. Huh. Okay. 
I mean, the idea of a bunch of secrets activating a cutscene is cool. I, I don't know if I've ever seen that before. And these are essentially, I mean, they not essentially, they literally are just the silver rupees, you know? It's just cool. Right, there was an area I could go up over here. Alright, what did that do? I'm drowning, the fuck? Can you make me drown less? I've been dilly dallying, dude. I'm fucked! I didn't know! I didn't realize until the beeping started. Just go to the surface? There was no way I was making it back to the surface in time. Actually, that's maybe not true. Wasn't I underneath a floor, though? Wasn't I underneath this floor when I died? Oh, thank you so much. Yeah, I was pretty sure I was under a ceiling. Don't think I was surface level at all after I went through that door. Ah. Don't eat me. No, it worked the first time. The water did remain lower. Very interesting. Alright, wasn't I... I guess I could've went back this way. And I probably had enough time if I knew exactly where to go, but... I was not right at the surface of the level, guys. I... There... It was blocked off. I should've went back for air, absolutely, but... It wasn't as easy as you think it was. Should've got good. What's up, Dr. Impossible? Always great to see you, dude. Yeah, so I needed to come out here to get health. They have redone the HUD, the health, really well in this game. To the point where half the time I don't notice that it isn't just the normal way the health works. Uh, shit. No! Please, big bitch, get away. Uh. No! No, 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 dude. <laughs> Go away. I don't want to get eaten. Damn, I was so close to surviving, and instead I was just panicking and looking for coins. Big fucking noob. Alright, the blue switch is down there. I have to climb up, unshrink, and then hammer this, right? Huh, okay. <laughs> this is so bizarre. It probably doesn't look like the platforming is all that different, but it fucking, it just feels so weird. I don't want to fuck the fish, personally. I've never, uh... I've never seen that side of Rudo's appeal. Not for me. Wait, huh? Oh, weird. I can only jump on it.
One more, right? Green fourth level. Not forest. Pretty cool. Oh. Here, give me your cloud? Nope. I so the wind won't get me as long as I time it. I see some absolute nonsense waiting to happen here with wind and Chuckyas involved. Like getting stuck in foreverness. Jesus fucking Christ, dude. No, what? <laughs> what does this do? Can I even get to it? Holy shit. I did it. Whatever I did, I did it. I did something. Are those slopes? Bro, they are. Oh my god. I mean, if you insist, I will ground bound on a tiny little slope. Like, I will do it. Okay. My plane's got a little bit fucked there. I, d I don't... I don't know if I believe. Maybe I just go all the way over. <laughs> Yeah, that's, that's what it is. Sorry, my epic awesome brain had different ideas in mind. Give me that coin. Oh. Yeah, this is gonna suck. Really bad. Wait for them to stop? Yeah, I'm done. Crawl? Every once in a while, every collective person in chat says something smart. Like, they all just come together for one unified great idea. It blows my mind whenever it happens. I just can't believe I'm in the presence of greatness. This just wasn't that time. This is hard as fuck. I just have to go. Don't, don't. This pause buffering is gonna get me killed. No! <laughs> this is why I safe stated. <laughs> I cannot play through the whole game again. I knew it was a, a risk, I couldn't have it. Alright, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Ah! I'm fine with having to restart the level. I was not fine with exiting the stage on accident. But that would have been really bad. Or really annoying. You're telling me, BLJ, the bridges? Look, you, sh you send me a video of you BLJ and the bridges, I'll never go a day where I don't BLJ the bridges again. You show me what that looks like, you teach me, I got you fam. Maybe that activates this fan over here. I, I'm i gonna assume, MW, that it does. I still didn't want to run all the way back. I 
I, I got this now. First try. Now that there's no pressure, things like this just never are hard. It's just when there's pressure, you're like scared and shit. <laughs> oh, I go in the middle, right? Wait, does this... Does this fix... Does this... Oh. Never mind. I was gonna say, does this fix the, uh, the barrier? Oh, yep, I'm using magic and I can definitely see where I am. Okay. Not a huge fan of this fucking camera. Don't jump into the room. Okay. That was my bad. Hey, let me leave and come back. Maybe, must be a video plugin thing? I don't know about that one. I can probably... Save and quit and come back. Okie ok, 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 dokie! Uh, my guess for why that happened is... Maybe there are some weird camera offsets between loading and exiting certain areas, so... If I did the rooms in a different order than you, then maybe that happened for that reason. Dude. There we go, fixed it. It's just a little bit too far back. Doubt entirely leaves you and hope fills your heart. With all powers combined, you are finally ready to lift the barrier. I tried C-upping the first time, bees. It just wouldn't let me. Or I didn't try hard enough. Well, now I can go to the castle. What do you have to say, Peach? You must bri- you don't care about anything. Yeah. Welcome back, Wow, Mario. Something about you has changed. It must be the work of the super blocks. I bet you could smash that barrier without even breaking a sweat. While you at it- While you at it, give that Bowser a good thwack to you. Good luck. Uh, for those who aren't familiar with, uh, the stuff that I know. Yeah. Thwack means destroy. Hey Mario, if it isn't too much to ask, could you hurry up with removing the barrier? I think the castle oven on. I probably have to use the hammer. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, Bowser, you got fucking decked before I even showed up. Oh great, if it isn't Mario, right on time to ruin everything again. Don't bother with the hammer, I'm not looking for a fight. So yeah, that barrier you just broke, I put it there to keep him out. This is my kingdom to conquer, not his. As you can see, he's done some remodeling. Pretty bad taste, if you ask me. Not nearly enough spikes. The lava's a good touch, though. This guy has no pushover. I had him on the ropes, but even with the power of the stars, he still won. He must have cheated. I can't believe I'm saying this, but I'm not going back in there, so it's all up to you. I'm gonna regret this, but take the power star. Or take the star power. Show that overgrown pig. Okay, that's just... That's just species labeling it, you know? At that point, it's not even funny. I think I'm gonna take a nap while you do all the work. Now scram. Thank you, dude. Thank you for that star. To everyone telling me to hammer him, yeah. I can fucking promise you that my first thought was to hammer him. <laughs> We're all on the same page. Chat really came together today. <laughs> I am just as dumb as everyone else. <laughs> oh shit. Automatically closing doors? This is a Zelda hack. Wait, is that parallel? Bro! You wouldn't. Okay. I don't think there's anything up there anyway. But what if there was, like, a toad just way the fuck up there somewhere and it was really, really hard to get to? Another weakling here to stop me? Pathetic. The last one I felled with a single strike and he looked far stronger than you. The Triforce grants me power beyond imagination. Not even the hero of the gods could stop me. What chance do you have? Bowser wasn't the hero of the gods, buddy. I'm way better than him. With the barrier gone, I will dominate this land just as I have Hyrule. Your stars cannot save you. Your fate is sealed. Behold the Triforce of the gods. <laughs> I love it, dude. 
Oh my god, this is so cool. Eh, fuck. Okay, well, I don't want a triangle on top of me. Even if it does make a f money bag sound. <laughs> okay, that thing just chases me. Can I damage him? I just want to make sure I have some options, if any. Ow. Video plugin is fucked. Then why did they tell me to switch to this plugin? I don't have another plugin for you. I have Jabbo. You get Jabbo, that's all. <laughs> Jabbo's the only one we haven't tried yet. I finally caught a Simply Flips stream. He spent one hour. I've tried two different versions of Glide. Well, Glide 64, Glide N64. Yeah, I keep forgetting I have a hammer. Like, this entire hack I've forgotten I've had a hammer. Oh! Well, that's new. I'm gonna run all the way over here. Hammer, fuck, too slow. I wanted to hit that back. Wait, let me do it again. That's why you can hold it, dude. That's what it's about. Oh, now I just have to hammer his pussy. Multiple hits. I think he's gonna kill me. <laughs> I might be able to clutch it out with half a heart, but I think he's gonna kill me. I hope that this is the video plugin that you wanted. I, I'm sorry that like half the plugins I own are not good for this. He looks perfect now, thank you so much. Okay. Thank God, dude, because I didn't have another plugin to choose after this one. I wish everything was so standardized and not every hack like relied on different plugins and stuff. Some hacks you, you're setting up two controllers like it's just, it's just getting out of hand. He did throw a fork because he's a fork head. And some good vibes. Thanks, Tyler. Tyler, you always get me when I'm winning stream soon. But oh, I got fucking stabbed. <sighs> I right, well, I was pretty sure I wasn't gonna win that fight on my first try. So I did get forked. Also, that wasn't your fault, Tyler. Promise. Let's go. This time he looks correct. My bad about the bad graphics plugin. Is it weird that I thought he looked great with the old plugin? Did anyone else think it looked great before as well? Like, obviously it looks great now. I'm not saying it looked better before, but I thought it looked great. I would never have known without being told that I had the wrong graphics plugin on. You thought both looked great? Me too. That attack is crazy. That one's scary. Okay, I just had to, I had to know for sure whether or not I could hit him, you know? Because he teleports around like a Link to the Past Ganon does. And you can hit a Link to the Past Ganon whenever you wanted. Oh shit. Wait, I could just be fucking him up then. Imbecile. This is the world's... Friendliest attack. <laughs> I can't believe I just got in twice. No.
Risky, guilty, greedy, all of it. And Bowser, you fucking act like you're sleeping every time I come over here. I can clearly see that you're awake when I load the area. He's using that move a lot because he knows it baits you. He knows that I have a small ass brain. That's so crazy that it looked as good as it did with the wrong plugin. Bad actor. Yeah. Has anyone in here seen the key and peel skit for, uh... Well, there's zombie extras in the skit. I, that's really all I'm gonna say about it. Same concept, though. Got one hidden. Alright, I'm gonna be successful this attempt. But I'm not gonna do any unnecessary risk. Yeah. To be fair, I couldn't have known he was gonna flick my head and I would fall over. But I didn't know that that was unnecessary risk. Yo, give me the magical ball. Loyalty trident. No, the ball, I wasn't ready. Damn it. I was too busy running around. I was thinking about how Vic sounded exactly like Navi in that other hack. Oh yeah, ball me, dude. Oh, let's go back to backs. Ball time. Oh, I'm definitely getting a ball in. Look at this. Or, I mean, a hidden. Aw, oh, fuck. He said no thank you. <laughs> All time? <laughs> Fuck! Fuck! I'm taking so much unnecessary damage! Cause I'm lazy, or impatient, rather. It's better. God oh, damn it. Fuck you and your triangles. Ah! Oh, well, now I know what that does. Alright. Patience only, from now on. I shall now only demonstrate the greatest patience in the world. Uh oh, I don't know how to avoid this. I'm going all the way to the throne. Get me out of here. I've been forked before. You learn from that kind of shit. How many hits? No idea. Uh-oh. He's forked. Don't come straight towards me. Holy shit. I'm looking at chat. He's going in the air, dude. It's time. I cannot fail. Oh, fourth hit! Fifth hit! Fuck! <laughs> I've been thinking the whole time it's never taken more than three hits. If they throw a fourth hit at me, I'm probably fucked. Then hit number five comes out of the woodwork this entire time. Hit number five has been a possibility. 
I was thinking the entire fight. Every single time I ran towards him after the third hit, that I would I would one day bite the dust because of my overconfidence. And I even got the fourth hit. I Well by far I figured out how you should fight this boss. You gotta get in early when there's the fire and just hit him a million times before you lose all your health. We're looking for a fire move one. If I can find him. That's a fork move. I, I'm not trying to get forked, I'm trying to get lit. I think I only get two hits this time. Dude, hit me with the fire move or the ball move? Aw, oh, ball master! <laughs> I'm doing much better this time around. He's, he's elevating. Uh oh. This is gonna be regrettable. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's go. Much better fight so far. Fire? Oh, whoa, this is shocking way faster now. Hey, fuck you, buddy! No! I couldn't! It wouldn't let me. Fire? Uh, get me out of here. You actually want to be schmoovin' when you get closer to the... I don't know, I assume the end. Fire? No! Let's go. Suck these balls. Okay, well I'm not gonna be getting in on those ones, but... Uh oh. Hopefully the fight's almost over. Oh, one hit left. Let's go. How is this possible? With the power of the Triforce, I should have been unstoppable. Bars? He had a pretty thick, pretty thick, a pretty fat rhyme before you died, dude. Wow, that's. Really well animated. Welcome, Mario. I am the essence of the Triforce. That was a sick explosion effect as well. Simply reach out and touch it. Oh, this is why it said I had to set up the mouse before, so I could actually click it. I've never seen a hack do that before, and I am making this up. I just made that up. <laughs> now reach out, Mario. <laughs> Sorry, you guys. <laughs> That was pretty boggers, bro. 
Ganon more like Shaman Pog Champ Pog Champ Pog Champ. The Snez Mouse. The first hack by Wise Guy and Sausage Sage. What an incredible hack for your first hack, dude. So sick. You're so sick. What a, what a great experience that was. Uh, okay, well, to vote, if you've never been to the stream before and you don't know how to vote, you just type a number 1 through 10 in chat. Uh, and if you guys could take the time out of your busy lives to vote for a moment, then that makes uh, all the time worth spending on this project, you know, worthwhile. So please vote if you were here and saw enough that you think you can have a, uh, a good opinion of the hack, you know. And I played this hack forever. How many hacks are left after this? Some of you might be wondering, and I too am curious. Uh... I think after this, there's like one or two more left. I have three left, it looks like. The red ones on the spreadsheet are left. One of them I can't do because they requested that I play it on console. I, I can't do it until I uh, get a cord that I ordered this morning. I, I had the cord already, but I can't find it. Uh, but basically it's because I, I want to be able to play that hack on EverDrive, so... We'll have to wait a couple days for that one. I am not doing them tonight, no. I'm not, I'm not much of a... Million Hour Streamer. I'm, I'm, I only like streaming for as long as I feel like I have energy to have a good stream. I don't like streaming for the sake of being live and like... Whatever other reason. Uh, please vote if you haven't. Final call to vote. Nah, I just meant like, well, let me end my recording first. Uh, thanks for watching, YouTube.